here with Joe Filicetta and the United Bow Hunters of Pennsylvania, specifically the Disabled Hunters Program. Our program is primarily funded by a banquet that we do every year, usually in April. And uh, what we try to do is send anywhere between eight and 12 hunters from the state of Pennsylvania on hunts all over the country that they would not otherwise be able to afford. We cover all their expenses from travel to if uh, we even have our own crossbow, if they don't have a weapon of choice, that you have something that they can use. So you gotta have the string carrier down. Yep. And then it's typically on fire. And you just press the button. We've got a good show lined up. Joseph Yarish, right? Yes. I'm Joseph Yarish. I am 15 years old and I am from Chambersburg, Pennsylvania. Joseph is a normal kid. Um, raising Joseph is just like his older two sisters. Mm -hmm. um, we found out September 11th, 2001, that the baby we were expecting had the most serious birth defect, spina bifida. So we were told poor quality of life, um, he wouldn't walk, um, he would struggle in school. We were advised um, to abort, and that was not an option um, for Mark or I. So um, we knew the baby that we um, were expecting was meant to be with us. I'm almost tearing up here. That makes my heart happy. And I can tell you from experience with Joseph that he is absolutely a normal kid. There's nothing, you know, he might have a couple arm crutches, but mm -hmm. other than that, he's, he's, a, he's a, a regular normal guy. normal 15-year-old boy. And we actually have two youth hunts. Uh, right after jo Joseph, we have a 10-year-old named Tucker. You guys will see that next week. Uh, but again, I want to talk a little more about what you guys do, not just the disabled part, but the United Bow Hunters of Pennsylvania. Responsibility is an important word. When you buy a hunting license, I think that makes us responsible, right? Yes. Not only for the animal and the landowner, but being active, part of your community, and that's exactly what these type clubs do. We are the state's bow hunting organization. Whether or not you're a member, we represent you at all game commission meetings. We have a representative that represents all bow hunters. Everything that bow hunters across the state um, all the benefits that you have is something that we've lobbied for over the years. So these guys are working with legislators to protect hunters' rights and the wildlife. They also do a special hunt that allows them to work with landowners. We help farmers out with an overpopulation of deer, and what we do with the deer harvested during this hunt is we donate them to a program called Hunter Sharing the Harvest. So it's a win-win-win. Our guys get a place to hunt, the farmers get some of the excess deer taken off, and we're feeding the hungry, and those, again, less fortunate. Exactly what I want to highlight, hunters helping hunters. Joe, I appreciate what you do, man. Thanks, Kevin. Thanks.